So a friend of mine just sent me one of his works recently that he did for a client and he told me if I submit maybe let me know if there's something I can do to make it better. Did you guys see that? Yeah. Oh, let's go. YouTube trial number 9500 on. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Ben, an editor who struggles with consistency on this platform. But today, if you've read the title, this will be one of those videos where I just, you know, shed light and maybe teach you one or two things. Once in a while, I get requests of people asking me, oh, can you check out my work? Can you tell me what I should have done differently? I'm trying to edit this. I want to send it to the client. Maybe tell me what you'll have done different and this is something i also do personally it's not it's not just other people because it's always good to get like a second opinion it's always sheds light to you know what you're doing as they say two heads are better than one so here's the video on the screen uh we have three people in the frame so definitely from that you know it's it's a dad it's it's three people talking to each other i haven't watched it yet so i don't know if they're all talking but one thing I can point out before you even start is whenever you're shooting uh, like dialogue, dialogue is those videos where people are talking to each other. It's always good to have multiple takes of the same conversation. So have like this frame, as you can see, is a wide shot where we see everyone and then take individual shots of everyone who's in the, who's in the scene as well. So this might be time consuming because you'll have to, you know, shoot this one then you start from tops shoot this one start again shoot this one but that's all that also saves you a lot when it comes to editing because now you have a lot of you know sh shots to play with so let's go It's a it's a good video of course i feel like it's you know the message is clear it's uh it's an advertisement and uh, i like the end screen this this bit yeah it's it's nice it's nicely done so the first thing i i think i have a few things to point out uh from just that uh first of all i'd be very worried if my girlfriend went and came back with an iphone that that is a legit cause of concern the second thing is you can see here when when before the video starts uh this okay let me not say this guy and act like i don't know him butita who i think is like the main character in this is facing down and then a few seconds like there's a few seconds of him being out of character and then he See, there's like, yeah, there's, there's, there's that, you know, there's that like, we see him getting into character on camera. So as an editor, that's something you should obviously, you know, remove. 
this thing should start somewhere from uh maybe immediately like he's in character like somewhere like somewhere there yeah yeah crazy so that's why it's important to have multiple takes because if honestly if it was me i would have started with his short shouting and then uh, cut to the white to see to show people what's happening so yeah that's one thing uh the other thing i noticed i don't know if you guys can hear but i feel like the music is a bit too loud for the music is a bit too loud yeah by sim yeah the music is definitely too loud so that's one thing that's another thing I'd, I'll, i'll let him know the other thing is uh remember when we were talking about having multiple takes so this is where now it comes in in this conversation they're mostly arguing you know they there's a lot of chaos there's a lot of back and forth uh argument type of vibe as an editor you have to you have to you have to kind of bring that out in your edits and one way of showing chaos even to the person who's watching you 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 can you can do multiple cuts like you can do quick cuts like i cut to this one i cut to this one i cut to her i cut to him i cut to her cut to him those many takes make it feel a bit frantic and a bit you know you get the idea yeah so it makes it feel like they're actually arguing but when you have a still frame like this we know they are arguing by how they are talking but you can't really visually feel it because you have to also feel it visually plus the the the, the wide last so long like that it's been almost oh my god it's almost uh 13 seconds without a cut <laughs> for social media that's not a good thing because right now bro our our attention spans are fried you know you need to pick keep people engaged and one thing one way of doing that is just by making quick quick cuts yeah plus we're missing a lot of reaction a lot of emotion from this shot like you see this this shot where he's facing the the dad like that's a very good opportunity for you to intercut you know create multiple cuts yeah you see he had the shot so it's just about or oh, something else the choice of music is very awkward you know it's it does i don't feel like it really it doesn't communicate what's happening you know it, it should be something more din 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 like arguing 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 something like that yeah but this music is more of like elevator music kina uko na hiyo pesa oh did you guys see that be oh it's so easy to miss this bro and it's so easy cuz it happens for like a second you know you obviously not supposed to be looking at the camera you know the, it has to feel like the camera is not there your talents should not be look should not even know the camera exists so this shot is a problem you know we need to we need to cut that out mm. the music mm. and here towards the end the camera stays on the dad for so long and he's still conversing with the girl so that is definitely not good like you need to see that communication and that response and that re- those reactions mimi pia niko na hii hapo una maanisha nikienda kwa ilo duka ulihitaji iPhone iPhone The music is definitely too loud. Yeah. Like at this point, it's a very good opportunity for you to show the character's reaction. Plus I feel like the main character has really gotten very very few shots, you know very very little screen time screen time yeah <laughs> like this part shows betrayal because he was calling his dad for you know like 
as a mediator to to be on his side to support him because you know the situation the girl is in is not a good situation but now they end up teaming up against him so this is a very good opportunity for you to show the the reaction of you know betrayal you know like ugh, crazy guys i definitely think uh that is it everything else is good i mean the color looks great the the framing is good um there is no boom sinking in the shot uh what else what else what else uh yeah it's it's pretty much okay to be honest i don't think there's anything else i can add to this yeah maybe just you know changing a bit changing the music a bit and making more making it more engaging by doing multiple cuts so yeah guys thank you so much for watching that's my video i hope you enjoyed it hope you learned something if you have any suggestions if you're a video creator and you'd like me to maybe watch your work maybe react to it let me know down in the comments below because this content is definitely here to stay i'm trying to be as consistent as i can this year create more time you know set aside more time for myself and hopefully before the year ends we might you know we'll be somewhere where we can do exciting things together so yeah thank you so much for watching Thank you.